Hey YouTube, I'm going to show you how to get an excellent special effects program. It's called Vision Lab Studio. It's um, created by FX Home, and they have um, three of our products that are very, very good for special effects, like FX Lab, Photo Key, and Composite Lab. Now, the three other ones are I might go over in a different tutorial, but on this one, Vision Lab. And on this, I'm going to show you how to get it for free. Now you can download the trial. It's a new version. It's it's no different from the version I'm gonna give you. Um so here we go. Now first thing you need to do is go to my website um for the link. Um go to the downloads tab and I'm put with Adobe programs because FX Home is associated with Adobe. So um it'll be down here. While you're here, check out our downloads and everything, you know, donate, yeah. And, um, after you download it, I'll take you to make it upload. See, right now, I'm actually uploading it. we done in 21 seconds. But, um, I'll take you to the, um, make it upload page, and all you do is type the little code in. If you have top, it's like four characters, and download. And you download. It's real quick and easy. And wherever it downloads to, you know, you're gonna get this. It'll be um it'll be a zip file. So um, what you do is if I have seven zip, you can use one or hard, doesn't matter. A seven zip, extract the files. After you extract it, you get a folder like this. It'll be the same thing, but just a folder. You open it up. You open the second one up, and you get these two things. That's it. You open this folder up right here, and you click on this. Division Lab Studio Installer. Now we click on it and install. I ran it installed on my computer. So, after that's done doing this bullcrap, you install it, right? After you install it, don't hit Run Program yet. So, in the last um, splash screen, it'll be like, Run Program after it's done installing. Uncheck that. And um, this key right here, the way I'm going to show you, you're not going to need that key. After it's installing, you see um, 300 and uh, 32 presets? You want to use those. You can put those on so you get more um, effects. And you want that. So go to your start, uh, computer, C drive, program files. FX Home Vision Lab Studio and presets. I um, copy and pasted all of them. So copy and paste all those presets into into here. Now come to the preset pack, well, which is right here. It's like 177. But we'll have 177 when you have 322, whatever it is, I don't know. But anyways, and okay. The next step is, is very crucial. To make the program actually run, is it done? Okay. To make this program actually run, you have to disconnect, the, you have to disconnect from the internet for just a second. So yeah, okay, I'll go to my program. in here okay now what I'm gonna do if you have XP it's very easy to disconnect and reconnect right for Vista is that the disable blah 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 pain in the ass so if you're in Vista you know it's not gonna hurt anything unplug your Ethernet cord or um, wireless wireless card at your um, computer and I'll unplug mine right now I just unplugged it. I'm no longer get connected to the internet, so that should make an X. You run your program. Oh, see, made an X now. Okay, Vision Lab Studio. Okay, as it opens up. Sorry, give it a second. All day long today, it appears I'm running very slow. I don't know why. Um, let's see, Vision Lab Studio. <laughs> Pain yes. Okay. Now 
that each time you open this up, it's going to load all the presets. All 323. Now, with the magic of editing, you're not going to see all these. So, I'll see you back in a minute. Okay, welcome back. <coughs> Through the magic of editing, it's almost done. Woo! Don't you wish everything could be like that? Go that fast? Well, not everything. But, the computers. Anyways, and after that, this will pop up. Now, if you're not connect, now if you are connected to the internet, you can do this. It will say um, a new version of Vision Lab available. You can hit download or cancel. It doesn't matter. Whatever you hit, um, hit the screen will pop up next, and you get two errors. And you cannot get past the errors. It will not let you use this program at all. You cannot use it at all. It will not let you. So that's why it's disconnect from the disconnect from the internet. And if you feel like being disconnected from the internet very long, after this pops up, you know, hit new or whatever, plug the cord back in. I see, I just plug it back in, so I should get connection back. And that's it. Really simple and easy. And look, I have all my effects. And see, I love this, like, look, blood effect, you know, muzzle flashes. There's a ton of them. You know, look at this. 50 caliber rifle. How kick ass is that? You know, you can just say anything. You know, it's quick, easy, and, um, see the good thing about, uh, this, you can edit all the particles for it, you know, you can, how long it does, and if it keeps flowing through, you know, if it's, uh, you can add uh, tails to it, you know, um, anything. I can, I'll actually post a, if anybody wants me to post a video on how to use this program, I will. I'm more than happy to because I love this program and I'll, I'll uh, post a video. And remember, every time you run this program, you disconnect from the internet. So if you use them for multiple projects, um, keep it minimized, you know. And it doesn't use that much memory. Um, Vista, a little more than does for XP. I tried it both out on my XP computer, but, um, awesome program you know it's not good for uh clipping media you know um if you have a video and everything and you want to add special effects to it i recommend you are you have another um video editing software like sony vegas or adobe after effects but i recommend sony vegas it's it's easy it's fun you know has does everything you want to do um but like you have your your um your video and you want to apply some special effects to it use this and then render it out put that back into your um, Sony Vegas and you know, all your special effects and we can actually do you can actually take these special effects and tweak them the way you want them and everything and render and render just the effect and put that see how it has a black background put that into your Sony Vegas and it will key out the black and that's really good you know that's what you want to do but um, anyways enough of that if you guys want more about this program and how to edit with it, let me know, and I'm more than happy to help. But, um, uh, my name is Tyler, and that's today's tutorial on how to get this. Check out my other tutorials and other free stuff, like The Sims 3. Check out my website, and, um, there's a cool forum I want you guys to check out, too. The link will be in the description. Go over there. It's amazing. Okay, um, and that is it. Alright.